a good day. This morning we are rebooting your fall fashion from slouch to combat. Boots are a fun accessory. We love incorporating them into our outfits. But sometimes it's overwhelming and you're mm -hmm. like, what do I do with this? It's, where do I start? Join us live with fall bootwear styles and trend stylist Pam Z from Equation and Edina. Wow. Hello, lady. Good to Hello. see you again. Good to see you too. Okay, we're not kidding when there are when so we say a there's spread. a lot of options. This yes. is just like a one percent spread of what you would see if you go to the store. Right. And, and, and I feel like people are like, what's the difference between this, this? So I'm gonna break it down. For You're gonna break it down. Right. First, starting with the just the different boot options yes. that are out there. Yes. First, we start with sock the booty. sock booty. Sock booty. So I love a sock booty. It can be worn underneath a jean, um, underneath like a cropped kind of jean. Mm -hmm. Gives you like that long length. They're stretchy, so any size leg can fit in there, any size calf can fit in there. I was just telling Pam, <laughs> mm -hmm. I'm not quite sure. Yeah. I've got some soccer calves from a. I don't know. We'll see. Okay. It, it is. It's really cute. They're very comfortable because it's like wearing a sock. So you can, I can actually run in those. Oh, so but you choose not to. I choose not to. Yeah, that's good. Um, okay. <laughs> I'm no Carrie Bradshaw. No. <laughs> yeah. I can't do that. Right. These are slouch booties. So these have a conical heel. So. Okay. Conical. And you say conical. those are actually pretty comfortable. The conical style is actually very, very comfortable. Hmm. I, I love them. What um, kind of jeans are? You wear okay. So one of my questions, I know jeans have become whiter. Yes. And so then I used we used to just skinny jean everything, and you just yeah. put your boot around it. But now I'm like I got some wider ones. I don't know what boots you to wear. You definitely can do a straight leg jean in tucked into the sure. Shirt. Okay. You'll see it. It's it's one of those things like it's going to take everybody a little bit of time to get used to it and the look. Yep. But okay. So the you'll... slouch booty, do you do you roll it? Do you not roll it? So this one is pre. This one I wouldn't. You wouldn't really roll, but this one can be worn just up like this. Okay. Or oh. I do a little roll. I think I wore these for family pictures with a dress, Cute. and I wanted to get a little like fun around the ankle type situation. Okay. Sure. This is the Chelsea boot, so I feel like this is the boot of the season. Everybody's yeah. talking about it. You see different variations of this everywhere, but this is a style that's been around for like years and years and years. Um, but Chelsea boot just basically means it has like a stretch panel on the side okay hmm. and they come this one I grabbed because I heard you talking about like how they can be kind of clunky yeah this one's actually like tamed a down sleeker. clunky you sure. know what I mean like okay. I feel like this is cute with dresses you wear it with like a little pair of jeans so you got the Chelsea and then you have the combat boot like yes. the whole Doc Martin that whole thing is back yes. you're rocking a pair that are like the man. so dazzled mm -hmm. oh uh, yeah if you're gonna go big or can if you you're gonna flip, do there you combat, go you can kind of see them right there. So we cute. can see the sparkle. At yeah, least. so I like to wear, if you're going to wear something that's like a little bit more masculine, like the combat boot sure. or something tie up, do it with a dress or yeah. do it with okay. a skirt. Do it with something unexpected to kind of juxtapose. Balance it out a little bit. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Next up, you've got the ankle boot. Ankle boot. So I brought kind of three variations. This would be, these are like your true ankle that if you wear with a jean or something, then you still get that pop of your ankle. Yeah, up, a, so. a okay. little bit of ankle. Which I always think is a good idea. No matter what boots you're wearing, like, unless it goes all the way into the pant, if you're doing an ankle boot, have a little leg showing. Okay. A little bit. That's good. That's but good these advice. are like a stiletto, like true ankle, more of a dressy. Um, you're seeing a lot of Western kind of inspired boots, and these are my favorite, obviously. Mm -hmm. you can they look them. very fall. A little worn. A little worn. <laughs> hey, that's okay. <laughs> Keeping it real, Pam. And then this is another ankle, again, with the conical heel. And these are just really comfortable. And, like, another way that you can play with shoes is, like, pick a pattern at make that be the pop to your outfit, you know? Okay. And then the hidden wedge boot, which I feel like everybody in Minnesota Pretty has much has, yeah. These. It's nice for the winter yes. because you can still get a little bit of height. Yes. But I mean, those two are, are waterproof and, and whatnot. So, um, do you normally see that in more of like a winter, like kind of a yeah, out, outdoorsy boot? Yes, you're seeing them a lot now, and they're putting bells and whistles on these now with like fur tie up. Oh yeah, and, I've seen those. But it's the hidden wedge. Love those. A little height, like, give you some stability. Winter, just right. Yep. Some stability I mean, on the ice a little Pharrell, bit. The same weight, like 300 pounds. Oh, <laughs> we have videos of tall we do. boots. Yeah. Okay, so these are all kind of smaller, shorter boots yes. and, and tall boots. I was talking about this. I struggle with taller boots because I'm not quite sure how to wear them without 
you know, feeling a little uncomfortable. Yes. Um, so <laughs> we first start with tall boots with jeans. So over the knee boots. These yes. are obviously. So this is an over the knee boot. Shout out to my friend Nicole for helping me. <laughs> um, this is an over the knee fitted boot. Okay. And so I wanted to show these off paired with like a lighter denim so you can really see that that's like fitting. And is that how you would leg. wear it? Yes. With a lighter denim? Or, you I mean, could do either, a lighter right? denim, you could do a legging, you could do anything in there, but I do think it looks very good with jeans. Okay. And that style where it's a little bit tighter fitting is really good if you feel like you have athletic legs or you're more on the petite side. Stick to something that's like closer to the body instead of like a boot that kind of shoots out. Gives okay. you more volume. Okay. Yeah. okay. This is a Pammy look. Love it. <laughs> a sweater and a skirt. Cute. And these are tall snake boots with that conical heel. And I love those boots. But just this look, so easy. I love a tall boot paired under a skirt, paired under a dress. So those go what, like up to the knee? Yep. But you wouldn't, obviously you don't really tell, but you can't really tell with the skirt. Yep. Okay, you want I like it, that. That one you want the skirt or dress to cover the okay. tall boot. Okay, last but not least. And then this is like a riding boot. So like a a good classic like flat with a tiny heel riding boot um, and that kind of gives me classic vibes you know we paired it with a plaid vest just kept it very um, I feel like I need to go to Martha's Vineyard in that and I watch know, but I feel watch like a it's polo a polo match work friendly oh yeah or like grab a cute bag put on some I love is you just showed so many different types of boots like we hear this is the trend but no all of these work yes. right right just how you wear them so yeah. we love it thank you for and all do the what advice you like, yes. right and go with the Pammy Z style yes <laughs> <laughs> you can follow her on Instagram at the real Pammy Z that you see right there at the bottom